and welcome everybody to the Hambert Ham. To bring in year 2026, we're going to make a CW contact on a Heathkit DX60A transmitter. It's got the VFO. We're going to be listening on a national NC173 receiver. It's been warming up for about four hours to maintain stability and now it's time to put it on the air with the hammered ham. So obviously the DX60 did not come with a built-in keyer. They didn't have it back in those days. So I'm going to be running a ham keyer box with a Vibroplex paddle. Let's see what happens. All right, this DX60 has been modified with the D-Lab push to talk module. So I've got the monologue switch and that will select transmit mode without having to fool with that function switch. So we're in transmit mode right now. Let's see what we get. Always ask if that frequency is in use. That's what we do here at the Hammered Ham Shack. All right, hearing nothing. We'll keep it short, because I'm probably going to have to retune that receiver. Nothing. Let's go again. So I'm on the 40 meter band, somewhere around 7.060. I think it was KK4BM. I'm not sure. First cue so down with a cat. All right, so reviewing that cue so, I missed a character. His call was KK4BMB. There's another B there. I didn't catch it until I looked over my notes and I was like, why did I put a B on that piece of paper? Yes, so I got that wrong, Ed. Sorry about that, guys. All right, let's try another cue so here at the Hammered Ham Shack. All right, I had to go up in frequency a little bit. I had QRM. Sounds like I still got it. The Martians. All right, I guess I'm gonna have to QSY again. We'll find a clear spot and try CQ. All right, got a new frequency. It appears clear at this time. Send a CQ. Always have to ask if that frequency is in use. Don't want to be one of those guys. Oops. There's somebody. It's 
Sounds like W A zero R A O. All right. Said he follows me on YouTube. <laughs> I have to let him know he's going to be on a hammered ham. Very cool. Cool. All right. So I told him that he was going to be on the next hammered ham video. Oh. When they call me. W4MY. <laughs> this guy's named Marty. I fixed his Johnson Navigator and he's on it. Pretty cool. Pretty neat to run across people on the air that know who I am. Especially on CW, because I mean it's a bunch of little dits and dots. And there's another one. Do we keep going? Alright, so I was gonna keep going. However, the Supreme Commander informed me that if I want dinner, she needs to be able to turn on the kitchen lights, right? Right. Yep. So when she does turn them on, it rips up this receiver, and I won't be able to hear any of this. So, I gotta go. But it was fun. Got to use the DX60 and the National 173 and make some QSOs, even though it was kind of a drifty mess. It was still a great time. Here, say your chat. goodbyes. Say your Hammer goodbyes. ham. Yeah, we're out of here. A little bonus content. The wife said, I've got 45 minutes for another QSO. I just heard somebody. All right, sounds like V E three M R X. Okay. W0 UI He's calling CQ So let's see if I can get him
What a night for the hammered ham. So we're in transmit mode right now. Let's see what we get. Always ask if that frequency is in use. That's what we do here at the hammered ham shack. All right.